and we're really honored to have with us tonight Mr. Steve Stout. Steve? I've never seen anybody not that's smart, that's paying attention, that has a real business plan, a real business model, something that makes sense, right? It makes sense, and they keep chasing it down. I've never seen anybody ever do that and fail. I've seen people quit and fail. But you gotta know if you have the stamina to run that race. What is the product you're selling? I represent Columbia Medical Center. We developed a hand sanitizer that's uh, superior to that of things on the market okay. today. Okay. The only problem is that the people believe that alcohol is the, is the ultimate solution, but in fact, it's yeah, not Yeah, it dries your hand. I got it. Okay. What you can do is speak to the, uh, the issues of surrounding alcohol. Um, there's been a lot of products in this in recently that's done very well that's failed because they 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 weren't they didn't have um, natural formulations. So within the last ten years, the consumer has gotten very smart, and the, and all the natural products like like Carol's daughter, like Bird's Bees, has put out a natural message to actually teach the consumer and educate the consumer the dangers of sulfate, the dangers of putting silicone in every single hair product. And when, they, when you teach the consumer and educate the consumer on the problem, and then your product becomes a solution, that's the way, that's the way I would attack that consumer. Hi, I'm Crystal Cotton, president of Crystal Clear Connections, and we're here at the Project Enterprise Service Showcase. So what we do is we assist people in developing their communication skills for the workplace and beyond. My name is George Williams from Ujama Communication. We're an IT and consultant firm here in Harlem, New York. My company is NY Surface Styles. We do decorative wall finishes for commercial and residential spaces. Uh, my name is Lennox Brown. This is very young, right? Uh, Co-founder of SuperheroCars.com. Uh, we're a business-to-business -business sales and marketing firm. It specializes in high-end vehicle sales and online marketing. We're wrapping up the evening. We just finished hearing a wonderful, wonderful presentation from Steve Stout. The audience was great. The questions were fantastic. What a great evening. offered a tremendous tool. We don't have to have Michael Jackson or Donald Trump type dollars to pretty much put ourselves on the world stage. So my big thing is using social media to brand. Never in the history of mankind has a person with limited funds been able to spend his six dollars, you need six dollars for your, well that's not even that, well it's more than that, it's about forty dollars for an internet connection and a free Facebook account and potentially have the world as his audience. So if you're creating content like blogs, you're in a really good position to use these social networks very efficiently. So I would start with Hootsuite. It's the tool I use, H-O-O-T-S-U-I-T-E dot com. And you can set up an account, and through Hootsuite, you can connect your Facebook account. You can also then set up a LinkedIn account and connect your Twitter account to LinkedIn, right? So what happens is you make one post and it goes to all your Twitter accounts if you've got more than one. It can go to all your Facebook pages if you've got more than one. And it can go to your LinkedIn profile, right? One post, and you don't have to go to 10 different sites to do it. Hi, I'm Mel Washington, Executive Director of Project Enterprise, and, and we are here tonight at Columbia University with our first annual speed consulting event. And I'm also here with Mike Katz, a board member of Project Enterprise. And Mike, I want to ask you, what do you think of this idea of speed consulting? Oh, I think this is really exciting, especially being in the first year. I think this is, this is a phenomenal success, uh, especially given that it's so critical networking in general to entrepreneurs and sole proprietors in general. I, I think this couldn't be a better experience for both our entrepreneurs as well as the consultants that are participating. una cuenta en una cooperativa, 
um, cuáles son las opciones, las instituciones financieras que pueden usar para ahorrar, para conseguir préstamos con tasas de intereses bajas y justas. <ríe> Esto es muy importante, ¿no? Um, y también cómo establecer una historia de crédito en este país, que es muy importante para personas que quieran cualquier tipo de préstamo. I want to welcome you to our fourth night, the Project Enterprises seventh annual Entrepreneur Week event. I want to thank uh, our partner and host tonight, uh, TD Bank, uh, particularly uh, Frank. You'll hear more about Frank in a second. A business starting up, what would be maybe three starter applications that every small business owner should consider? Well, I, I would definitely consider um, a sugar CRM or a Salesforce.com. What they are are actually a customer relationship management system. We're here. People are not going away. But the technology will help you enhance your business and make it easier. You can set up your payroll. You can do ACHs. You can stop checks. And you can do that at midnight. You know? So or maybe if you're working nights, you do it at 7 in the morning. So from our aspect, our, you know, our, our application, our online banking is simple, it's easy, it's free, free. Mm -hmm. and it'll, it'll make your life a lot easier in business. I use it for myself, you know, despite my wife liking to write checks because she likes to feel the checks. Not, come on, just pay it online, what are we doing here? It's crazy. So it's available. Use it. Cost you nothing. And the, the demo online at, at td.com, it's real easy to go into the demo just to kind of play around it and check it out. So one of the systems that I would recommend and absolutely tell you today to look at is Intuit. And Intuit, it produces a, a very popular uh, product called QuickBooks. But they've done something. They've made it software as a service. Yay. And what that means is, and this is really great, I run my whole business on it. I've run two businesses on it. You absolutely can do everything from wherever you are and you just have to send a login to your account. I think tonight was very energetic and a lot of the people were really looking for information about business tools and in the current economic climate people are sort of making decisions, very uh, serious decisions about where to spend and so tonight sort of brought home for people what they can do with small budgets for uh, big access to new clients and information so it was a great panel. Tonight's uh, panel was just outstanding. I think the panelists uh, conveyed a great deal of wonderful information on technology for the 21st century and I think uh, Steve here did a super job he was um, uh, spot on on uh, all of his uh, input to to the panelists so overall how did the networking event go I thought the networking event went well um, we had about 20 to 30 b small businesses uh, come talk with uh, the business school people, um, first years and second years, just imparting some knowledge on small businesses in the community. I've been getting a lot of feedback from the businesses, emails, uh, so there's going to be some follow-up. So I think it was uh, pretty productive.